Hello and welcome to the Panasonic Studio at the Toronto International Film Festival. Union Square is a film about two estranged sisters who have an unexpected reunion. Mira Sorvino plays one of them. Mira, your character in this film is kind of a teeter-totter of emotions and humor. Is that something that you try and juxtapose in all of your characters? Uh, this one, this character was written so well and so uniquely when I read it on the page. I was just feeling really, really fortunate to to get to play this person. Uh, I think it is rare that you have so much humor and so much emotional depth in one person and such a kind of a high-flying persona. You know, she's really sort of bouncing off the walls and yet at the same time she comes down to land for these very lucid moments, you know, where she utters some of the truest things in the film. Um, but uh, yeah, so I think it's actually unusual to get a role that combines comedy and uh, pathos in the same part. There's such, such a strong influence of women in this film, a female director, writers, editor, uh, producer. DOP, producer. Yeah. <laughs> Why is it so important for women to tell stories about women? Uh, because women understand women, so I think that they are wonderful people to make stories about women. And Nancy is such a brilliant woman. I mean, I love hearing her talk about the film. I loved working with her on the day. Uh, she just really understands human nature in general. And I think she makes a film that actually, although yes, it is made for women for made by women for women, it's actually made for everybody because we've met with all these men that have seen the movie in the past two days, and they're all saying, you know what? I really related to this story. It really re reminded me of my relationship with my family. Jenny, Lucy. Oh my God! Hi. How crazy is this? This is so crazy. I didn't think that you were gonna be here, but you're here. This is amazing. What are you doing here? Listen, listen. We gotta forget everything that happened, all right? Whatever you said, whatever I said, we gotta forget it, get over it. I don't want another three years to go by like this, all right? All right? What would you say is the underlying message of this film? I think that the truth will out, <laughs> and that it should, because trying to hide from the reality of your life, however painful it might be, just kind of puts off the inevitable and makes you kind of unhappy inside, even if on the outside everything is sort of placid. Um, but also that love, if it doesn't conquer all, really does go a long way. And at the end of the day, you know, this reunion between these strange sisters played by me and Tammy Blanchard, we really do at the end like refine our love for each other and, and that, that that is really important and you shouldn't let, let go of that. Thanks, Mira. Thank you very much. He thinks we're from Maine. What? Maine? Jen! <laughs> Why does he think Maine? We're out like trapping moose in the North Pole? No, that would be Alaska. I said Maine. Whatever! It's messed up! Could we please not talk about this while he's here? I'm just saying you went to a hell of a lot of trouble to get rid of your family, Jennifer. Shh. Remember to follow us on Twitter at Red Carpet Diary or like us on Facebook for all the latest from our interviews here at the Panasonic Studio at the Toronto International Film Festival. Oh.